Okay, let's do this gig. Whatever that gig is, right? Let's go. V, got a simple gig. There's a van sitting at a Revere Courier Services facility. You're gonna break in, clap it. If you wanna know what's in the ride, check the attachment. Okay. Uh, still a Revere Courier Service van, right? Combat jackets. Okay, fine. Let's go and do that. All right, let's see this guy. As a result, inhabitants of the South Pole are still enjoying life as Antarctica's first dollhouse was recently opened. <sighs> Come on here! Anybody else? Anybody else want a piece of me? Ah, here. Alright. Let's take that. Uh, E955, E9. Authorized personal link. Nice. Alright, fine. Uh, we will take that. Let's go.
received. Textbook example of a job well done, don't you think? A plus <laughs> plus. Nice. Street Cat 4. Alright. So. It said there is a. NCPD thing in progress. So we can do this one. Cyber Psycho again. Uh, let's see what this gig is. Right. So listen, Maelstrom's got this Ripper doc. Thing is, they're keeping her against her will, forcing her to work. Okay. Could you go grab her from those psychos? Her brother would be grateful. Deeds attached. Sure. Mark needed. All right, fine. Let's see. So this one, go to the clean cut building. Aha. Uh, BD one C one C. Okay, we'll take one C one C. No five five, so one C five five. All right, that's fine. Let's take that and as always we're gonna go gun blazing right so come on here <laughs> Don't shoot. I'm a doctor. I'm not part of the gang. I know. You're Lucy Thackeray. Uh, text blacked out again. Piece of shit. <laughs> and you are? V. Your brother sent me to get you out of here. Bertie? Okay. Okay, just a moment. Look, we don't have time for this. That they've got in here belongs in a scrapyard. We got a Delta now. Since you're still here, run a scan on him. No. I'm sorry? Enough of this shit. We don't have time. He's gone. Of course. Shouldn't have expected anything from someone like you. Tell me, 
Do you feel anything at all when you kill someone? In the game? Nope. Not a damn thing. <laughs> oh, so you're a tough guy, huh? We don't have time for this. You'll crack eventually. You'll see. Come on. After you. Keep close to me, head down. Come on. Just a little farther. You ride, get in. Come on. Body nine. Final. Die, die, die. Only affects shotgun, LMGs, and HMGs. Light machine guns and heavy machine guns. Uh, wrecking ball. Crouched, right? Yeah, I, I want this one. Small target, blind spot, exposed, killer instinct. I think this one I want later. Alright. Let's go. Hey! It's, it's me! The guy who. You know. Uh, the guy with the smoking crotch? Thanks. He's gonna buy me something? Oh no, thank you! If it weren't for you, I'd... <laughs> Oof. No problem. Oh. Go get him, Tiger. Alright. So, we were saying... What kind of stuff you got? Yeah, let me see. My shield. Right. Uh, I like this one, heal on kill. So we'll buy that. So I'm full now, right? Edge Runner, Renaissance Punk. So that's where. Okay. All right. Let's see what he has to say. To control your executives, your leaders, but they are not human. No. But then what? You ask. Yeah. Reptilian! <laughs> you can recognize them by their cold blue eyes. Creatures born centuries ago on the Antarctic ice sheet. They hide their true faces under masks of human skin. If it's such a big giveaway, won't they just install optics? Or use contact lenses at least? If it were only so simple, they are reptiles. Their nervous system isn't compatible with human cybernetics. <laughs> Why not have their own rippers invent some? Are you sure they haven't already? <laughs> and where did this filth slither out from, you ask? Antarctica, you said that already. Today they hide amidst the snow and ice of the South Pole. Step by step, usurping our crown as creation's chosen. Millions of years ago, they evolved from dinosaurs to become the world's first advanced intelligent race. And who is their progenitor? Their masters? The scientists of Alpha Centauri! <laughs> Pretty funny, man. Alright, let's go ahead and make Dex. Alright. I 
I knew it. Uh, looks like there is a NCPD crime somewhere nearby. I was trying to help you guys. Whatever. Yo, Mr. V, a pleasure. Yes, to Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bangle? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? Blaze of glories all the way. It's yep. first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scav home. Tell me more. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech. A biochip, to be precise. Jobs to grab it. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. Not at all. Corps don't deserve special treatment. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> you ain't playing around. No, man. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolve in that. Second, to rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue she needs resolving the Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military tech. Cause if we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate one Simon Randall, AKA Royce, plain dropped his ass. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aims to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this shitstrom, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Who's the prima donna? <laughs> Corpo agent, internal affairs. Been skitting around town asking after the convoy as if her life depended on finding it. The one lead she's got zip-tied in her trunk. Stick up her ass ain't growing any shorter. 
So she must be getting desperate. Be wise to think how you could use that. Of course, to do so, you'll need that frazzled cat's info. Sending it now. Client, what's her thing? Why she need to meet? Woman's name's Evelyn Parker. Betting her wasn't easy. Put the word out I was looking for any kind of intel. Right, and? Some brothers from Pacifica got back to me. Told me to stop looking. End the convo. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> our little client insisted on meeting someone with skin in the game. You know, who'll be there for it all. Yours truly will be remote. T-Bug ain't no people person, and Jaggy's only good at some things. I know you know what I mean. Pretty much leaves you. All right. I think I got everything. Time I got to work. Well, that's just music to my ears. I'll set up the meet with Miss Parker at Lizzie's bar. Flathead, though, is gonna be all you. Okay. One more thing, Mr. B. Quiet life or blaze of glory? Hmm? Blaze of glory Later all now. the all the way. In Cyberpunk? Of course, Blaze of Glory. Jackster, talk to Dex. <laughs> yeah, Gordito's a big deal. Literally a nod, yeah. Guy certainly knows how to protect his biz. Wants to put us on a few small kinks. Prep work, I guess. Before lining us up a big job. There's this combat bot, military prototype. Maelstrom clept it. Then Dex paid to take it off their hands just before the gang goons had to switch up in management. Right, right, heard about that. Royce versus Brick, hostile takeover. That sums it up. Dex wants us talking to Royce. Gave the deets of some Militech agent too, but I don't know how much help she stands to be. Then there's the other thing. Gotta meet the client who put the job on the table. Evelyn Parker. You? Well, what's Dex gonna do? Ride around in his limo, chat chicks up on the hollow? <laughs> Parker wants to meet someone on the crew. Dex gave me the nod. He must know what he's doing. So, how you wanna play this? Maelstrom or Parker? What's first? Uh, gonna meet client. Parker. I think I ought to see her first. See what she's like, what she's after. Orale. In that case, I'll hit the all foods. My nose to the ground. Stick around. Hasta luego. Nice. Alright. So. Let's update our character. This is inventory. Oh, the P is the character. Okay. So I'm thinking we can go into. So we have the body, reflexes, technical ability, cool. Let me just check the ready and rested assault rifle and SMGs, dash. Yeah, this would be nice, right? This would be really nice. And then we can get the air dash. And then we have lead and steel. So I want to get to the blades because I like using the blade. And then blade runner. Yeah. I'll probably go into reflexes. So let's go. Nice. I think this would be nice, right? Army of one. Alright, that's fine. Only affects shotgun and what's this one? Wrecking ball. Only affects blunt weapons. Alright, that's nice. Alright. Where do we need to go? Uh, Regina Jones is here. Let's let's go through this cyber psycho. It's here anyway, right?
All right, let's do this. All right. Neutralize the target. Let it go. I'll rip out your spine. Finally! Hmm. Alright. Electric baton alpha. Psycho tank top. And euro dollars. Uh, okay. Blah 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 blah. That's fine. Let's send it to Regina Jones. <laughs> nice. I mean, she didn't give me a chance. What do you mean, too bad? 